Good morning. This is Lisa from Happy to Hook Creations. And I'm hoping that you are seeing this on Wednesday, uh, the 24th of August. <laughs> I've been doing so many videos. I don't know, guys. Oh, my goodness. I am really going to try to not make this one go very long. But um, I wanted to talk to you about my trip with Rose and my birthday gifts. Yeah. So I'm going to just warn you right now. <laughs> you might want to get something to drink. Get you a cup of coffee. Get you some tea. Whatever. Get you some crocheting to do while you watch what I'm going to show you. Because um, there's quite a lot. <laughs> and um, so, yeah. Just be prepared. Okay. Hi to all my subscribers <laughs> from the beginning till right now. Thank you guys so much for hopping on here and joining my channel. Um, for all of you new people, let me, sh I'm, I always forget to turn that down because it just really messes things up. So for all of the new ones, if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa. This is Happy to Hook Creations. I have been Happy to Hook Creations now for about 13 years and I am a mother to four children three of which are grown I have one teenager left at home for the time being because we are also a foster family I have five grandchildren one dog and lots and lots of fish <laughs> and I don't have a lot I've got like a 55 gallon tank and there's like 22 fish in there and there might as well be like two <laughs> it's like so my daughter tells me, we need to go get more fish, mom. And I'm like, yeah, we do. So that's probably going to be a trip today. <laughs> anyway, I am drinking. You don't, can't see the other side, but this was from a swap. My Alaska cup. I really love this one, too. It's really pretty. So it's got like purple, the bottom and then and the top there. And um, today, what am I drinking? I just put it in here, guys. Coffee blend or breakfast blend coffee with peppermint mocha cream. It's it's like a hot York peppermint patty. <laughs> I love that so much. Okay, so <sighs> Sunday the 21st was my birthday. And since a lot of places are closed on Sunday, Rose and I decided to meet up the day before on the 20th so just this past Saturday I drove to Orland Park oh man you know I just forget how many wonderful things are available in a larger town let me tell you I was such a happy camper I was so excited so <laughs> because Rose kind of snuck up on me <laughs> we had agreed to meet at Joanne's and this is not our first meetup we met once before, and uh, the first time Rose drove um, farther, and this time I drove farther. So we agreed to meet at the Joann's in, or in Orland Park. Guys, it's huge. I mean, wow. <laughs> it's a really big Joann Fabrics. So so they have two entries. There was one on the side where I parked, and there, were, there was one on the, uh, the front of the, like, outlet mall. So, of course, I'm like, I, I sent her a text. I'm like, I'm here. And I was looking everywhere for her. And she says, I'll be there soon. You know, just a few minutes. She sent me her ETA. So, I'm just kind of walking around. Um, it, it was, I just could not believe how big this place was, guys. Um, so, then she sent me a, a message. And she says, hey, where are you? Where, are you? where did you park? So, I told her where I was parked. And she... <laughs> The whole time she's texting, she's inside the store and she's, she's looking for me. So when I turned around, boom, there she was. It was, and so I went, ah, you know, and people are looking. It was just so great. I love, love, love meeting up. And, um, yeah, Rose. So if you're watching, we definitely have to already plan our, our third one. Cause I had such a good time. Rose is absolutely amazing. You guys, um, she has such a good heart. I, I can talk to her like I've known her my whole life. I mean, it's just amazing. So <laughs> we did some shopping at Joanne Fabrics. And I'm looking at all my stuff. I don't even know where my Joanne Fabrics bag is. It might just be 
you know, jumbled in here somewhere. So I'm so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you what we purchased after I <laughs> after I tell you about our wonderful trip. So let me let me um do that first because I like I said, I had such a good time. She's so easy to talk to. Um so man, we were like talking about crocheting and different patterns and what do you use I'd be like so how do you make this and what do you what do you do with that and and um I she's got me convinced that I need to make an octo it's a pattern by rel of the dabbling hook I'm gonna find that pattern I'm gonna get it and I'm gonna make an octo because I just I mean I'm not a, uh an amigurumi person but Rose Rose is like nah, if, if you can make one or if I can make one so can you I'm telling you you'll like this pattern so if you haven't tried that, you guys need to head over to Rel. Um, I believe her patterns are available on Ravelry. And again, she's the dabbling hook because I'm going to buy it. So we started at Joanne Fabrics. We were there so long. <laughs> we had to go get lunch. <laughs> so we went um, and ate. Where did we eat? We ate at Red Robin. Oh my gosh, I had this, um, I can't even remember what the burger was called now. I like spicy food. So it had like, um, it had deep fried jalapenos, some kind of hot sauce and pepper jack cheese. It was delicious. <laughs> it was so good, you guys. We don't have a Red Robin, but I've eaten there before. So after lunch, then we we went over to Hobby Lobby. If I can, if you're watching this and I can figure out how to put a video up, I will. Otherwise, you guys need to look it up. This Hobby Lobby had escalators in it, okay? That's all I got to say. <laughs> you can check my Facebook page, which is attached to my Happy to Hook um, creations. And I'll tell you, I, I put a picture up. It, it's just absolutely the biggest Hobby Lobby I've ever been in. I could not believe it. It was so fantastic. So we went in there. Um, they did not have yarn on sale, which was a major bummer. But we found other stuff. And, you know, it's joint or it's Hobby Lobby. So there's there's something you can find. Although we were specifically looking for yarn. Um, but that's okay. Um, so uh, after Hobby Lobby, we went to Michael's. <laughs> I totally lost it, guys. They had some stuff. So, yeah, there's that. And then from Michael's, we went to Dollar General, Dollar Tree. Yeah, yeah. So, I was there all day. I got home at like, I don't know, a little after nine. Oh my gosh, I had such a fabulous day. One of the best days uh, for one of the best birthday weekends that I've had in, in a, quite a while. So Rose, I want to thank you for giving me such an amazing day of friendship, fellowship, and yarn shopping. Because I'll tell you what, I had a blast. Who wouldn't like to shop for yarn, right? So <laughs> I'm... I'm I'm fixing things up. So my my cakes and larger yarn, I, I'm going to have to put it on this wall because I have ran out of space. But I have a thing for cakes. I don't know what it is. They're gorgeous, maybe. I don't know. So so I'm moving things around on this wall. As you can see, I finally started my, my um, cotton. I got everything put together and got that started. And these are almost all filled up. I only have three left, the bottom three. So that's my new halo. I figured I'd put them there. I don't know if they're going to stay there. But anyway, so I'm I'm looking around and I'm going to try to find the bag for Joann's because we did get some stuff there. I got some, some gifts from Rose because she is a, amazing. Um, oh, here we go. So there's this one. Okay. I, I have a lot of stuff, you guys. Um, oh, there's my water bottle. I've been looking for this bad boy. Ah! Oh, my gosh. So, yeah. I'm just going to let that stay there. I can't even... Well, the bags... I have two bags this size. Okay. 
The bag was a gift from Rose. And it is so awesome. I love it. So I'm trying, let me, I, I probably should have separated this, you know, earlier. But I did not. So let me, let me just kind of hang them out, hang them out of, or get them out of the way right now. So what's in here? Oh, okay. <sighs> My lunch bag I was looking for. We don't want to open that up. I'm just saying. All right, guys. <laughs> let me get scissors. There we go. It's like, I know I got scissors in here. Okay. So let's open this bad boy up. All right. So if you follow Rose and myself, um, Rose and I, I don't know how that looks, on Facebook. If you're not, you definitely need to go over there. She has like a few questions you need to answer. And I've got one as well uh, to be a member of our Facebook page. Because there's pic there are pictures up of us at one at, outside of Hobby Lobby and then another one inside of Joan Fabrics when we bought, uh, what, what did we buy? Big Twist. Yes, Big Twist yarn, right? So, um, some of this was a gift, some I purchased. I don't need, you don't need to know which one's which. Just know that I got this at Joan Fabrics. <laughs> Um, Rose was amazing though. And Rose, again, thank you. <laughs> so we're looking around and we're feeling yarn and, oh, and I, I have to mention that we met someone. Her name is Iris. So Iris, I really hope that you are watching. We stood in that aisle and talked to her for probably 15 minutes because she heard us talking and she stopped and said, hey, can I ask you a question? So then we just started talking about craft shows, um, types of yarn, what to make. <clears throat> Excuse me. It was so awesome, guys. I love meeting new people who enjoy the same craft. I'm telling you, it was great. And she is quite talented. She showed Rose and I pictures of some of the bags that she had made. It was really nice. So Iris, if you are watching, it was such a pleasure to meet you. Um, and I wish you well at your craft show. So this is a new one that I, I haven't tried yet. It's a hundred percent premium acrylic, 311 yards or 285 meters. So it's a number four. It could be, yeah, I guess it could be a number four. It looks, it looks thicker. It says that the recommended hook size is a 3.5. I don't know, guys. I don't know. That looks kind of thick to me. This is, let's see, what's the colorway? Because I thought this was gorgeous. Uh, rust red. Okay. Look at that. And I got two of those. Isn't that beautiful? So when I saw this, I was thinking about Halloween. I don't know what I'm going to make. Probably just a hat and scarf. But like I said, there's what? What did I say? 285? Yeah, two, no, not 285, 311 yards. The, that was the 285 was the meters. But yeah, I'm going to pop them in this bag. But there are those. That was enough for that one. Then I got a color of Red Heart Ombre that I've never had, which is the green apple. So the big twist was on sale. 30% off, maybe. I think it was 30% off. Um, we used coupons for some of the stuff as well. So I, I don't remember what this was, but I like the green apple. Now, the big twist was definitely on sale two for five. <laughs> um, and I had a few colors and then I put those back and because I wanted to match. <laughs> Rose had some and I wanted the same, the same color that Rose had. So... Um, it was just, man, I just had so much fun, you guys. So these, you know, these are 380 yards. I don't have a lot of big twists. I've got, um, you know, maybe just a handful and even a few of those were gifts, but they had such pretty colors. So each one, so each, each one of these is going to have 380 yards in it. They're all the solids and they're a hundred percent acrylic. And you know, this is soft yarn. Um, not as soft as some of the yarns that I have, but for, you know, a value yarn, this is great stuff. It's made in Turkey. 
And I bought, let's see. I know they're going to tell me what the, the colorway is. So I have a hot pink. I have an orange. Is it just orange? Oh, it's varsity orange. I've got, where's the that? Um, Cer Ceraline Blue. I, I hope I said that right. Looks like almost like a periwinkle to me. There's that. So that's the picture because I'm holding all these in my hand. Because <laughs> we were like, no, no, I want that color. Jade Green. And then I put a few back. I'm like, you know what? I got plenty of those. Let me get one like you've got. <laughs> and this one was one. I got this yellow. This is Varsity Yellow. This is what I make my minion hats out of. Um, I haven't really made anything else other than a rainbow blanket. So minion hat and rainbow blanket. So it'll be good for that. That is why I got this purple. This beautiful, beautiful purple. It's called Grape. Look at how deep purple that is. Isn't that beautiful? Man, that is a good color. And then they had, is this lavender? Let's see, where is it at? Lilac. So they had a lilac. I don't even know if I can hold all these. I think I, I think maybe Rose was helping me because I still have two more to go. All right, let me start putting some of these away. But I mean, aren't they beautiful? Just look at all the colors together. Oh my gosh, you guys, two for five. That's just a crazy good deal when you get 380 yards in each one. So I have two left. This one is plum. And then this one is teal. So these are great. They're nice and vibrant colors. They're not, you know, they're not dull at all. And I just cannot wait. And I've got variegated yarn that this would work with. So, you know, I don't know what I would make with it. Ponchos, what have you. I don't know. So I need this bag. So I'm going to put this stuff back in here because, you know, I got a lot to show you guys. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And so while when we were in um, when we were inside Hobby Lobby, it started raining so hard. It was crazy. <laughs> so it just gave us more time to shop. So we did. We just stayed in there until, <laughs> I even think Rose said, I think we've been in here long enough that that storm's over. <laughs> Man, I had such a good time, guys. I really, really did. Okay, so this is my gift. This is a bag that Rose had for me when I arrived. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm trying to get the, um, I know there's another one in here hiding. There's more. Okay. So you guys know I've been making the Ring Around the Rosie vests out of the Discontinued Lion Brand Ice Cream Cotton Blend yarn, right? The Cotton Blend. So they make, they do make other yarn, but this is the Cotton Blend and they don't make this one anymore. So if you don't have this in your stash, you're going to pay... I've, I was looking and I have seen these for like $13 each, $8 each, you know, on like eBay and Etsy. So, um, she had some in her stash and I know that there's, I think three or four of these in the bottom. So I'm not going to show you more of them, but I got some strawberry cause they're in the bottom underneath some stuff. And she gave me lemon. This one was one of my favorites. That oh my gosh. This one and the grape. Ooh, they just turned out so pretty. I loved it. I loved it. So I'll get to the other ones. They're in the bottom. But And I got some cakes. Oh, I love Karen cakes, you guys. Karen, Karen. I don't know how to say it. But oh, they make such pretty yarn. <laughs> I love this. Bumbleberry. Isn't that gorgeous? And it's chunky. I like chunky yarn, too. I like all yarn, let's be honest. But isn't that beautiful? That is just gorgeous. And then I got... My chair needs some WD-40, people. I got a tea cake. 
And this was a colorway I haven't had before. It's called Rainfall. Look at that. It's got teal and like a dark gray and then a plum, like a purplish color right there. It's so pretty. Ugh. And I, I'm not sure if these are, um, if this is a new or discontinued, but it's an eight and a half ounce and it's 204 yards for the chunky cakes. And then there are three of these, nope, four. Four of these, and I've never had this one. So this is the roving ice cream yarn. Look at how beautiful those colors are. Let's see, this is, oh my gosh, there's 437 yards, guys. In this seven, it's a seven ounce ball. And this is called, what, where is it at? Sweetheart Sherry. Oh, Sherry, that's just sweetheart in French, but. Um, so that's Sweetheart, isn't that beautiful? I love it, I love it. Okay, this one's probably my favorite. I don't know what it is with blue and lime green lately, but man, do I love them together. This is Razzles. Look at those colors. I mean, that's beautiful. I really, really like this. 400 yards. And this is a four weight. Uh, let's see. Recommended hook size. What's that say? So the recommended hook size for this yarn is a K. That's what it says here. Because it's roving, I think. So there's that. And then I've got... Uh, cool blue and it is really pretty as well look at all those colors I know it's cool blue but it kind of reminds me of a cloudy sky where it's a little blue and then you've got some clouds that's what it reminds me of I think it's beautiful and this one is <laughs> cotton candy look at all those great colors is it, is it focusing get out of the way there isn't that gorgeous and it's soft it's really soft it almost feels like brushed acrylic let me see what what does it say this is um yeah it's 100 percent acrylic oh it's so look i'm just like Ur. it's squishy and delicious <laughs> and i got a crystal cake i don't have one of these either oh i'm so excited and um, this is amaranth. Okay, but look at that. Look at that. That's gorgeous. Ooh. Just got to feel them because it's just so awesome. And these, so the crystal cakes, how many yards are in here? It's an eight and a half ounce. Oh, 634. That's nice. Such a nice amount. So this could be a shawl. This could be a hat and scarf set. Could be a poncho. Hmm. So many possibilities, guys. So many. And then a latte cake. I've got a few of these. I think I used them all. This one is colorway velvet teal. Look at how beautiful that is. Oh, it kind of matches my shirt. Look at, isn't that weird? I was I was doing a video with the um, <laughs> with the halo, and it matched. So this kind of matches because it's like blues and teals. That's funny. Mm, it is so soft, man. I love how soft this yarn is. Okay, and then the then there's four more of these, right? And then most important. <laughs> So Rose from from my Rose my Rose Rose likes crochet. She does stitch markers. She puts them together. It's a lot of work, but she makes some amazing ones. So these are going to be earrings for me, not stitch markers because I needed some. Oh my gosh, you guys. Seriously. This matches my shirt perfectly. I didn't even and I had on a different shirt this morning. You see that? Look at those, and then look at my shirt. I will be putting these on today and wearing them to work. Those are, look at, because I like dragonflies. So, yeah, she brought these to me. Eek, I love them. So this was such a nice birthday gift. Thank you. 
and the stuff in the bag. Oh, man. You know, you guys know how to make a person feel loved. And Rose was just, oh, it's just really nice. I love it. I don't ever worry about turning another year older. To me, it's a blessing. Um, and when you have friends like Rose and you do, you know, who share a craft like you do, and you can talk to someone like that, it's just, it's a blessing, I'm telling you. So if you got somebody like that in your life, definitely do not, um, <clears throat> don't let, don't let that friendship go to waste. Do whatever you can, because it's just <clears throat> such a great, great blessing. Okay, so this was my, <laughs> my Joanne haul. I'm looking at this bag. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay. So where did I say we went after that? Hobby Lobby. So Hobby Lobby, this is this is sad. They didn't have any yarn on sale. So this is my Hobby Lobby bag. Could have been so much better. So I did find a yarn that was on sale. It's called Hue IQ, the Yarn B. The colorway is Coronation Ball. I do wish they had more because it, it was really pretty. So the look and um, feel of this reminded me of Hometown USA. That was one. If you looked at the last video, I was like, it's Hometown something. My my um, teal cowl, it was Hometown USA. But look at those colors that are in there. Isn't that gorgeous? So that was that was it for, for that. And then they had some really neat buttons. So, you know, I make cowls and I put buttons on them. So they have that one. And then they had this one. And they weren't very much. Yeah, 49 cents. And let me see. Did I get another one? Um, oh, yeah. And I got this. I bought this for Abby. Look at how beautiful that is. To make a necklace. And then I got some wiggle eyes for my octos that I'm making. Ah, I'm serious about those octos, you guys. So that was my haul from Hobby Lobby. I'll tell you, I was just like, I just stood back and I was like, whoa. Because you expect it to be, you know, <laughs> a normal size Hobby Lobby. And I'm like looking up at this thing and I'm like, I got to get a picture of that. Because it was huge. My gosh, I'd never seen one that size, guys. It was crazy. Um, okay, so I'm going to show you, even though this was our last trip, I'm going to, I'll do the Michaels because there's quite a lot of it. Just saying. Um, so, yeah, so we went to Dollar Tree. And I always get these neat looking, um, it's not like a journal. It's a, let me open it up so you guys can see it. Hold on. Look at how neat that is. So someone who's doing a swap with me, that's what I bought these for. So I'm not going to show them to you again so you can forget about them. <laughs> but I like, I like putting books in there because everyone has a list of something they need to write down. So I always like to have a book available just so, you know, that I can jot something down that's in my head or write something for a pattern that I want to look up or whatever. You can even look, you look, use it for grocery lists just as long as you have it there. Um, I bought some really neat stickers. This was because Rose was like, I buy stickers and, you know, um, use them for my shop. And I thought, what a great idea. And because mine, my, hold on, let me show you. So my business card has a heart on it with some yarn going through it. So I bought heart stickers. They had heart stickers. And then they they actually had yarn that I never used before. Well, the colorway, not the, the brand, because this is Premier Just Yarn, but it's their tweed. So I bought five of them. It's the color, let's see what color is this. Rust, it just says Rust Tweed. But isn't that pretty? I think that's really pretty. Their yarn is super soft, you guys. Oh, it's really nice. So, um... I don't know what I'm going to make with it yet, but like I said, I only got five of them. Oh, we shall see. So I'm going to put that there. 
Oh, and that the bag that I showed you, I got that from Rose as well. This big bag here. And let's see. Yep. Okay. <laughs> I've got stuff over here for my family for my birthday. And then I've got this one. So let's talk Michaels. So Michael, oh, Michaels, guys, they had a bunch of clearance. It was huge, first of all. So I have a Michaels that is about 45 minutes away from where I live in Springfield, Illinois. So every once in a while, I'll go in there because I can't, I don't know about you, I can't ever find clearance yarn online. It's always sold out. Drives me insane, but whatever. So <laughs> when she said, okay, let's head to Mark to Michael's next, I'm like, yeah, let's go to Michael's because they'll have Karen cakes. I hope they're, have, you know, e even if they're not on sale, we can at least look at them, right? They had Karen cakes on sale, you guys. Yeah. Sit back and relax. <laughs> because, yeah. So I, they had um, in the aisle, they had a bunch of Karen cakes. I'm just going to throw this down here. They had a bunch of Karen cakes, you guys. So if they at least had two cakes, I bought two cakes. I didn't go... Because, you know, there was one style that had like, you know, seven or eight of them. I didn't buy seven or eight. I just bought two. I just wanted two of each unless it was something I really liked. And then I did buy an extra. So uh, what I'm going to show you now are, um, I bought two. Hold on. Um, so they had several skinny cakes. I love skinny cakes a lot. It's 8.8 .8 ounces, and there's like 795 yards in these bad boys. Now, these were all on clearance, so, you know, I, I'm i sorry if you don't have them, because this was a really big Michaels. These were all clearanced for five bucks. So, yeah, if you have a Michaels close to you, and you haven't been there, maybe you might want to check it out. I don't know. But this is um, called Pop Rock, and I really liked those colors. Get all those blues, really nice. So where can I put this? You know what, I'll toss it in there. So I got two of those. I hope you guys are like, just eat your breakfast, man. It's gonna take a, a minute. <laughs> yeah, this one's rainbow, and it's beautiful, look at that. Man. Ugh. So I like using these to make just feel festive shawls. Perfect. I love it. That's beautiful. That colorway is just so beautiful. Okay. Um, I'm going to grab my other bag. Oh, I'm just going to show you the bag. Let me see. Here's the bag. And this is another bag that I got from Rose for my birthday. Look at that. <laughs> So I don't have to show them all to you because like I said, I did get two of two or maybe more of some. So, oh, so this is Spectrum or Spectre. What is it called? Let me see. Spectrum. I was right. So this is the Spectrum yarn and I made a just little festive shawl. This is one of my favorites. I made the shawl, took pictures with um, my daughter, Amanda, wearing it from, I put it on my shop. Um, I made two of them because this one sold right away because the colors, when you work them up, they're just beautiful. They're just beautiful. So yeah. So two of those, that's Spectrum. So I'm gonna toss this over. Oh, that rainbow. Oh my gosh, that rainbow, guys. And this was one I I hadn't had before. So I couldn't, be, I just couldn't believe how much they had left. You guys, it was like, a, it was like candy to me. I mean, you, it's just like, cause I, I don't have a lot of time to go to Springfield because it's 45 minutes away. By the time I get home and now that I've got all my craft shows and stuff lined up, some weekends I just don't have time. Um, so I have a daughter that lives just maybe 20 minutes outside of Springfield. So sometimes I'll call Jessica and I'll go, hey, I need you to go to Michael's for me. <laughs> and she'll go to Michael's for me. It's not the same, no. But when you can get there and you see all this yarn that they've got, it is so wonderful. And this one is tiramisu. And I see uh, shawl, poncho, and you know what? 
This is 795 yards. Ooh, I'd like to make another kimono. I think that would turn out really pretty. Because I got, I had two of them. Yep, got two of those bad boys. This is another one I haven't had before. Baked Alaska. Nice neutral colors. I love it. Okay, then... Let's see, this one is, where is it at? Vanilla bean. Oh, I guess I don't need to show you both. <laughs> but I did get two. It's kind of ratty, but it's okay. We don't care what it looks like. That's, an that's another one. And I thought someone called me, sorry. This one is Lime Twist, which I really liked. Um, and that's an extra, so I'm not going to show you that one. That's just a double. I did get one of these. Rose and I got some of this one. This, because um, I, I want to make an octo out of it. But this is the only Ogo I got. They had several. And I had already purchased some at Joanne Fabrics, um, like last month or even the month before. So this one is Indigo Fade. Uh, 220 yards. That's enough for an octo. That's what I was thinking. So, and it's pretty. Who doesn't like blue, right? Blue is pretty. I like it. Look, look. They had a latte cake. This one is, <laughs> the colorway is kissy kissy. But it it's cute. It's got, it looks like it's got peach and gray. A light and a dark. So, yeah. And they actually had two of them. You guys, I mean, my Michaels that's here, it's always out of stuff. I just get so disappointed every time. It's ridiculous. Then they have this one, and it is Buttermints. You see all those greens, and it's got yellow, teal, and blue. I like this one, too. It's very, very nice. So I'm going to sit that over there. That's Spectrum, that's that one, that one, that one. They only had two um, two cotton cakes. This is the funnel cake, and it was that same, that same Cyrilene or something. Must be some kind of, I'm probably saying that wrong, so. But it's, yeah. Where's it at? C-E-R-U-L-E-A-N. So however you say that, that's what that's what the colorway is. And it is 425 yards in, in this one. And so it's cotton. So it's so oh. and look, I had more blue cotton than I did anything else. So I have to put this down at the bottom. But that's okay. That's all right, because I got it. And this one was really bad, but I have one already. And I desperately needed another one, okay? And this one is Blush and Bloom. And look at, see, it's kind of like, but it's not tangled. It's just kind of coming apart. But I think that's beautiful. Daddy's going to take you. Have a good day. I love you. Yes. Yeah. It's Wednesday. <laughs> Sorry, it was Abby. <laughs> um, okay, and then there's, I mean, it's just, look at those colors. So I had this and I really liked it. I'm like, man, I got to get another one. I was really glad it was there. No, for your next one, I didn't get anything off on it. It was already clearanced. And Rose was like, just get it. She's like, that's just on the outside. The inside looks good. And I'm like, you know what? You're right. So <laughs> I got it. You don't have to tell me twice. Okay, so, oh my gosh. This one, I like the unforgettable and like the landscapes. I think they're just beautiful. Um, this colorway was, what is it? Heirloom. So the colorway is heirloom, and this was also clearanced. And I think that's really pretty. Never had the heirloom before. And I did get, they had two, I got the two that they had. And then this was a gift. Well, was it a gift? I can't remember. Rose, did you get this for me? Or maybe she had a coupon. She gave me her coupon. That's right. She had a 40% off coupon. How awesome is that? But this color, wait till you guys see this. It is so beautiful. 
It is the Facets Yarn by Loops and Threads, I believe. Yeah, Loops and Threads. Oh my gosh. <gasps> it's so gorgeous. Are you ready for this beautiful lusciousness? Look at that color. I mean, honestly, people, that's beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh my gosh, you guys. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm, I see that I'm already at 40 minutes, but I told you guys it was going to be a minute. It, it's, it's, yeah. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> the last thing I got from Michael's is this beautiful Karen chunky cake. It reminded me of Americana. I love that. Uh, the colorway is trifle. It looks, don't, does not look, you know, red, white, and blue-ish. I love it. There's gray in there, but I think it's really pretty. And I got two of these. And it's chunky and luscious and delicious. And I can't wait to figure out what to make with all this stuff. <laughs> and I got this for my office. Um, you know, I should have got two. Maybe I'll put it here. Because I've got lots of, I don't know, maybe the office. But look at that. New week, new goal. <laughs> I thought that was nice. So, yeah. Okay. So, <laughs> um, what do I have left? Oh, yeah. My birthday present from my children and Jack. So, I got some really nice yarn that's new colorways or colorwise. The colors are new. Um, and I remember having one of these oops, from um, a while back. So this is my Hobby Lobby birthday, birthday from my children. <laughs> I can't keep up. You guys just, I mean, you really know how to show a girl some love. So we got, or I got the Sugar Will Cotton. This is Cappuccino Foam. And there are two of those. Aren't those colors beautiful? So Jack said that Abby picked most of the colors out. Not too shabby. And I got a gift card. This is the soft and sleek low low pill fiber. Hi, Mr. Happy. Good morning. Um, this one is blushy. Look at how pretty that is. Isn't that beautiful? I love those colors. Um, table, living room. Um, you need to take the enterprise today. Okay. All right. <laughs> Sorry. So let me explain. <laughs> Cause I'm sure you guys are going, why does he have to take the enterprise? Um, so when we bought our hybrid, our first one, it made this noise when it went from, um, gas to electric mode um and it made a noise that kind of sounded like the enterprise when you watch when we were watching the movies so because we had just recently watched it and then when we bought the car last year jack was like wow that sounds familiar what does that sound and then we watched the movies like that sounds just like the enterprise taking off the rest is history i'm just saying so yeah it's called the enterprise it has been from day one <laughs> so there you go the other hybrid is a TARDIS because we are like super duper science fiction nerdies. And it's just the TARDIS because it's blue and we're sci-fi goofies. So this <laughs> this is a Sugar Wheel blue, uh, blueberry cream. Oh, this is just so pretty. These, what do they have in it? 300, yeah, 355 yards of this. Let me put that. I like showing the opposite end of that so, that, so you can see it all in its glory. I think they did really good. And I don't know if it, it just feels softer than it's ever been. I don't know. So I got two of those as well. There's the second one. This one is one of my favorite new colors, you guys. I cannot wait to work this up. This will definitely be a vest. I don't know if it'll be an adult vest or two child size vests, but it is called Strawberry Swish. So this could be, maybe I missed it. I don't know, but I've never had this color. And they're both different in the middle, but they're both strawberry swish. Aren't that, 
aren't they beautiful aren't that well you know what i mean see i get like so like uh, excited those are beautiful and i went back i liked this so much i went back um after work yesterday guess what they're sold out so i mean it's a 30 percent off this week and i could get some online if i want to but i'll wait because i got such wonderful gifts of yarn from so many wonderful people in my life yes rose you're included <laughs> um so i also two must have been the magic number so i also got two more of my key lime green as you know i make shrek hats and this is the color that i use so i will start stocking up um so that i don't run out and i will use them so <laughs> oh i love that color and then this is another sugar wheel it's cotton and this is citrus grove it's beautiful i've never seen this color before you see how beautiful that is man that's pretty i don't know mm. abby did really well i'm sure jack helped i think he helped with this one so this is the last one this is the last one and this is terracotta isn't that a beautiful color I wonder if I have room over there. Yep, I've got room on the other wall because I've got some pumpkins and probably just, yeah, like a pumpkin color and I don't know. But this terracotta would fit. It'd be a little dark, but I'm going to put it in that spot because I've got more room for it. So I'm looking around just to make sure that I didn't forget. So, okay, so that's my haul <laughs> for... Oh my gosh, my birthday. So awesome. I mean, my gosh, you guys. It was such an incredible day. And I'm going to put these on right now. So thank you guys so much. Um, I, again, this is, this is going to be like a 40... What are we at? We're at 47 minutes right now. I'm taking these out because these really will match my shirt. And I'm going to have to remember to take them and I'm going to put them on. So... Um, I had a wonderful time. Rose and I will definitely do this again. I don't know how soon with um, all the craft shows that I've got coming up for the weekend, but we're definitely going to plan another trip. And, you know, I'll, I'll meet up. If you're close, I'll meet up with you. I don't have a problem with that at all. But I love me some Rose, you guys. She is wonderful. And, um, yeah, just thank you guys so much for <laughs> being patient while I showed you all of my yarny goodness. I had a fabulous time. If you are anywhere in the Orland Park area, you should definitely check out those stores. Because like I said, that Hobby Lobby is just huge. I, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We just had such a great time. It's nice to shop with someone, like I said, who shares the same interests. Because man, <laughs> you can have some fun. <laughs> and we certainly had a fabulous time. Um, I'm looking around. It, uh, I... I have so much to show you guys still, but I'm doing, I've, I've probably made like four videos in the last week, which is unusual for me, but you know what? You do what you got to do, right? Especially when it's, I've got so much to show you. Thank you so much for your support of my channel. All the birthday wishes when you guys went over and, and saw Rose, her will, she'll always be linked in my description box. Um, as, uh, along with some other people that I like to watch some, you know, patterns that I really like to do. That's why you see such a large list in my description box. And a lot of times if I show you something new, it'll be down there as well. So if you are not, um, a member or a follower, you need to go over. I'm on TikTok, Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook. And, you know, I'd love to have you over there so you can see what goes on when I make a post and have a wonderful day. I'm just looking around at all this greatness. Now I've just got to find some place to put it. <laughs> what a wonderful problem to have is all I'm saying. You guys have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you so much for watching. Have, uh, or not have, happy hooking. Happy hooking guys, seriously. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>